The situation in Gaza continues to escalate, with Israeli forces launching attacks on Palestinian journalists, further hindering the flow of information and communication in the region. In addition, the recent accidental killing of three hostages from Israel by Israeli forces has added to the already staggering death toll in the area. A correspondent, Nur Harassin, has the details. Why the internet and all the network are cut on the Gaza and we lucky journalists are using uh, some emergency lines even though it is very dangerous to use them because we have to go to an area near to the border just to have and connect to the internet. Israel continues its attacks on Palestinian journalists. Uh, yesterday an uh, Israeli strike hit to the car of the Al Jazeera team killing the Al Jazeera cameraman Samir Abu Daqqa while Walid Dahdouh was uh, injured this is happening while there is another very important uh, news that happened actually today the idea of the israeli forces killed three hostages three israeli hostages when they were uh, walking out of a building and they were actually uh, holding white flags they were screaming in hebrew help help however they were killed accidentally by the idf and uh, this shows that maybe the idf do not actually know who and uh, where they are targeting and this only proves one thing that no one is safe as long as you are inside the gaza strip